Let the games begin. The Alabama State games are right around the corner, and the Wiregrass is gearing up for a lot of exciting events this weekend. Participants from all over the state as well as surrounding states will come to the Wiregrass to compete. Competitions will be held in over 20 sports in Houston, Dale, and Coffey counties. No matter your age or athletic ability, organizers say you can participate. We may have some athletes there that are world-class athletes, but we'll have a lot of folks that aren't. And so it's for everybody. And so it's not a it's not where you have to qualify, so it's a, it's a true, for every Alabamian that wants to be involved, there's something in our game they can do. The Alabama State Games were founded in 1982 to get people interested in Olympic-type sports. The first games were held in 1983. A lot of different uh, bases from all over the state of Alabama, such as Harvey Glass, Bo Jackson, Gene Stallings, uh, so it's a great, unique uh, ceremony for the state of Alabama for a long period of time. These games are the second longest running state games. Organizers believe that's because of community involvement and people's love of sports. It's a joy to me to see when I get to spectate and it's a joy for them to participate. When you have something in common with someone because you play sports, that's big. Just that small connection of wanting to know more about a sport, I think that's what really brings the connection to everybody else. Winners will have the opportunity to compete at the national level. In addition, nearly $15,000 in scholarship money will be given to athletes who win drawings. Now we have the opportunity to have academics and sports and combine both of them together, together and have one big um, organization that gives back to the community and to the state of Alabama. The games will begin with an Olympic-style opening ceremony Friday night at 7.30. Doors open at 3.